What's up, people? Welcome to the channel. My name is Freeman Sources, and you know what we do. We push you to the brim of your fitness level. In this video, I'm about to unlock the general requirement for graduates for the Ghana Immigration Service. And to help me do that is my brother, Nelly GH. Hello, viewers. This is your man, Nelly GH. And I'm here once again to push your man, Freeman Sources, to the brim of his fitness level. Today, we are here to unlock various requirements that a graduate needs to join the Ghana Immigration Service. Watch out. My man Freeman says, if you are born ready, I need you here right now. I'm here, bro. I need you here right I'm now. I'm here, bro. Yo, yo, yo. You know how we always do it. I know, right? Yeah. So without wasting much time, you know. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm really thinking of the first tax to give you, you know. What's that? Uh, I think today is a good day for me. So let me just, let me just give you, give me 10 archer push-ups. Okay. If you are new to the channel, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also drop a comment for us. You know what we do, right? We'll be educating you on a daily basis. Don't get it twisted. Let's go! Okay. Two. That's one. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. One for mom. Oh, eleven for daddy. <laughs> Twelve <laughs> for her. <laughs> Thirteen and for her. <laughs> Fourteen. <laughs> Woo! 15. Nice one there, nice one. That's a great work there, my friend. Thank you. Okay, okay. So now, uh -huh. the first requirement, if you are a graduate and you want to join the Ghana Immigration Service, the requirement is that you must be a Ghanaian citizen by birth with no criminal record. Mm. You must be a Ghanaian citizen by birth with no criminal record. Okay. The second one is you must possess a first degree not below a second class lower in social sciences or humanities from an accredited university. Yeah, you must possess a first degree, not below a second class lower, in social sciences or humanities from an accredited university. And the third one is you must have completed his or her national service. Uh huh. That's another yeah. issue. Meaning that that graduate must complete his or her national, national service. service. You know, this uh, graduate not people that not normally serve yeah. their national service. So, oh. yeah. They will always ask for that certificate. Yeah. So let's move on to the next one. Mm, what would I give? What, what have you eaten this morning, dude? Uh, I had some chapatis from Kenya. Wow. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Is it what I'm thinking? No, 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 no. Is no, she no. around? No, 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 no. You know Are you I'm, sure about that? No, I'm playing on that. Okay, right? so you just give me 15 plyo push ups. Woo. 15 plyo. 15 plyo. Right, let's yeah. get it. I'm, I'm really pushing you this morning. Let's go. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Ah. How was that? It was, it was good I, as usual. The Kenyan food is really well. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Kenyan food is working. Yeah, it is. Mm, I need to visit Kenya. I think yeah, mm, next two months. I need, I need to visit. Try it out. <laughs> see if, if if your prayers and your blessings are touching as well. So on to the next requirements. Uh, the graduate must be computer literate. Okay. Now we are living in the computer world. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. the graduate must be a computer literate. Must be a minimum age of twenty one, okay. and not more than twenty eight. Right. So that's that should be between. Ages between 21 and 28, not less than 21, not okay. more than 28. Okay. And must be physically and medically fit. Physically and medically, medically fit. fit. In our next episode, I will be giving you the necessary medical requirements. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, that'll yeah. That'll be good. That'll be good for now. So, on to the third, last set of requirements. Um, what, what, what would you like to give? What would you like to give your viewers? 
I don't know anything. You because say. Uh, your viewers said I should push you to the frame of your <laughs> fitness level. Yeah. As you always say. I know, right? So, okay, you just give me five knee tap. Okay. Five. Just give me five. Oh. If you want to dash us five in addition to we making it ten, <laughs> that's up to you. All right, hit the subscribe button, guys. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, Woo! six, That's hot. seven, Woo! eight. Come on, let's go. Woo! Nine, last one. Woo! Ten. Come on! Ah! Oh. Oh my! Ah! You need a coconut water right now. Yeah. It looks yeah. simple by simple. itself. That's yeah. not simple, though. <laughs> That's not simple. So, okay. So this one says, the graduate must be of good character. The graduate must be of good character. Must not be bonded. Simply right. means you must, you must not be married. Okay. Yeah, you shouldn't be married. Yeah. So you must not be bonded. Must have a minimum height of 1.73 meters. Okay. A minimum height of 1.73 meters yes. for males. All right. And 1.63 meters for females. Right. Thank you guys. Really appreciate you, boss. Yeah. Well done. You're well always done. doing it for well us. Done. Back well to done. back, you know. Well done. If this was educational enough for you, educative enough for you, and you've learned a lot out of it, please don't forget to hit the smash, hit, smash the like button. I said hit the smash, smash the like button for Nelly GH and myself, Freeman Sources, and the man behind the camera, Midi K. He does everything for you that you watch on Daily Gages. Drop a comment on what you want to watch on the channel in our next one. Until next video, we say we out. Let's go! Let's go!